Welcome back. It's been a while. Been a long time. Been like a couple months since I posted anything. Um, kind of wanted to take it easy till the after the first of the year, see what was going on with YouTube. But we're back. We're gonna be doing some different kind of stuff. Um, not so much Disney stuff anymore. There's a million people doing stuff like that, and I have to work. And it's not easy getting there all the time, and we don't have passes anymore. It's so expensive. But we'll still do some really fun stuff. Um, so just check this video out and let me know what you think. So, here I am outside the Dollar Tree. I'm gonna take a chance. I'm gonna go in and buy dollar steaks. Let's see if you can eat them. Not sure if they'll let me film in there, so I'm not going to try, but I'll show you what I get when I come back. So there it is. Stampede Boneless Beef Ribeye Steak. Mechanically tenderized. Not sure what that means. I can just picture like some giant hammer whacking it. But it contains 30% water and has sodium phosphate, dextrose, salt, and bromelain rubbed with seasoning. Tenderized with bromelain. I don't know what that is. I'm gonna have to look that up when I get home. But yeah, now here's what it really looks like. And I'm not sure beef is supposed to be that color. They are a whopping 3.5 ounces. Though. I bet you they cook down to about an ounce. Ooh, look at the look at the fine marbling on that one. Mmm. So we'll see. We'll go home, let them thaw in the refrigerator, and then I guess I'm gonna eat them. Okay. I don't know how that's gonna work, but we'll find out. Well, okay. My ribeyes are all thought out um, just took them out of the refrigerator so we'll show you what they look like and we'll get ready to grill them up so here they are I found out that that bromelain stuff is uh, an enzyme found in pineapple stems so it's used for tenderizing it's also used to help fight inflammation which is really weird so hey one positive, I guess I won't be inflamed. But here, let me flip this over. Look at that. That looks delish. Mmm. Oh yeah. Just for comparison, I uh, went to the Publix and bought a good steak. Just to kind of show you what a good steak looks like. Look at that. You can hardly tell the difference. And this, that's a ribeye, mm, ribeye, awesome. So I'm gonna open these bad boys up and we'll check them out. So I took them out of the package. Um, it's just, they felt so weird and nasty and it's gonna, uh, I don't know. I don't know. I'm gonna do it. So I'm just gonna season them like with a little salt maybe. Uh, I don't know, not, not much. I, I want to get the true essence of the goodness of this dollar ribeye. Oh man, especially this one. That one was, they don't smell bad, so that's a good sign, but that one was nasty feeling. Ugh, it's almost like coming apart in my hands. I, I think they would make really good fish bait though. So I don't know, maybe we'll try that at some point, but oh. It's tough, so let me season these up, fire up the grill, and we'll see what happens. So they're all seasoned um, as a reference. That's just the normal fork. I wanna see how much they actually shrink up. So, yeah, about yay big. So we'll see what happens. I'm gonna get that grill going now. <laughs>
they look like? Kind of. Didn't. I don't know. I don't know. They did lose a little bit of size. They kind of fell apart on the grill. Um, I don't know. It's kind of weird looking, but doesn't look terrible. We'll see. I mean, it was scary putting it on. I don't know if I really, I can eat a lot of weird stuff, but I wasn't too sure about this. We'll see what happens. All right, here it goes. Um, a little nervous, but I don't think it'll kill me. We'll see. It's okay. I'd eat it again. It's not that bad. Probably better. You could probably make some really good like Philly cheese steaks or something out of it, but it's really not that bad. Who knew? Dollar ribeye. Mmm. I'm gonna eat the rest of that stuff. It's not fish bait. It's good. Mmm. So I survived. Dollar ribeyes from Dollar Tree. You can eat them. Who knew? Um, and yes, I did get a haircut since then. Thanks for noticing. I can't get anything by you guys. It's a little crazy today, though. Um, that's about it for today's video. Uh, make sure you... Hit the like button, subscribe to our channel. There'll be more fun stuff coming up that can do a lot of things that pop into my head. The kind of, have you ever thought about this or that? That's where the whole ribeye thing came from. Kind of wondered one day, I wonder if you can eat that stuff. But remember, um, subscribe, watch our videos, share them. Now let's go have some fun.